welcome to Cars of 100 and on today's review I have this beautiful 2018 Honda Civic EXT so let's not waste any more time and let's jump into it In order to enter this beautiful Honda Civic Coupe, we have the nice Honda key fob here. You have lock, unlock, twice for automatic remote start and hold for trunk release. You also have a panic button here as well. You can start this car by pressing this twice and holding second time. And the car will start like that. And to turn it off, you click twice and second time you hold just like starting it and car will turn off by pressing this rubbery button here or having a sensor behind the door handle to open the door like that as you can see these door cards are really nice this car comes with cloth material seats and cloth continues on the door panels as well but very nicely designed automatic up and down for the front um, windows since this is a coupe car very nice door opener here very nice trim this is soft touch material very nice very good stitching here even though this is cloth material still looks nice still looks very interesting you have a trunk release button here you have a speaker housings here you have a twist on top very nicely designed door cards even though this door cards is huge still you have a very nicely designed coupe here overall the entrance is really big just because this is a coupe version of a car you get very good accessibility to the driver's seat or the passenger front passenger seat not so much for the back seats but we're gonna look into that later yeah. very nice seats speaking of these seats nice bolstering below since this is a somewhat sporty car bolstering on top as well you sit low in this car as you can see here you sit low in this car it feels sporty very nice steering wheel as well overall redesigned cockpit in these civics are really nice so let's jump inside very futuristic design here uh, i reviewed odyssey recently even though that was a minivan still uh, these cars have the same uh, design language as being the same automaker and uh, you get this futuristic design which uh, i tend to like you know this is a mixed uh, feeling to these cars but uh, you know as modern these cars get as more futuristic they will look so let's start this car This is a full digital display. And uh, it looks really nice. It looked really nice on the Odyssey and it looks really nice here as well. Because this is a coupe car, it is more sporty, it's more suitable here. You have a very nice futuristic display on the left for the engine temperature and you have a also gauge here for the fuel. Very nice. You can also 
I have the different options in that menu there so you can go through different options there and this looks really nice you know really nicely thought of and you have here controls for the sound you can you also have here controls for the media as well uh, you have different options here that you can go through by clicking this button as well uh, really nice uh, very nicely uh, you know uh, visible you know everything is in bold it looks nice it feels good when you're pressing these buttons feels premium very nicely uh, leather wrapped steering wheel you have also cruise control options here on the right as well uh, very nice uh, design for the steering wheel as well feels somewhat thick for the steering wheel you have very nice stitching here very nice design on the stitching as well the engine start stop button is red it's really cool this infotainment uh, which is kind of a mixed uh, feeling not everybody likes it and not everybody hates it so all the touch controls here uh, you have to get used to them you have no buttons for the infotainment except for the steering wheel here but uh, touch feels okay uh, overall and uh, I think you can get used to it a fairly good size display here you have very good climate control here it's a dual, dual climate control here as well up front you have heated seats here in this car as well even though these are closed seats still right now cars come with uh, heated seats with closed seats very nice shift lever here this is a CVT transmission uh, also mixed review some people like it some people don't like it but um, overall it's very efficient you have very nice brake hold here you have an ecom button here uh, to save even more gas than this car already does and you have a parking brake here a very nice cloth material here different than on the seats you also have here storage as you can see uh, it's pretty deep this storage is really deep even though it's not that uh, wide it's still really good in terms of the depth and you have a cup holders here that you can move around which is really cool so if you have things here you can move them around you have also USB options there as well as you can see this dashboard middle storage here you have a USB option there as well but that is for the phone as you can see the logo there and you can put the wires through there that's really convenient this is rubbery material here on top for things not to slide around very nice glove box plenty of storage around and speaking of this dashboard really nice design overall you have a speaker housing there uh, nice design and uh, I have also here a window sticker for this car and feel free to pause the video at any second to go over these features that this car has for standard and for some of the extra features that this car comes with and 35 mile per gallon combined is really good for this car and for the final assembly point for this car as you can see it's Canada so this car is not uh, built in Japan but still is a very well built car for the back seats as you can see here this seat person sits comfortably here and there is a plenty of room in the back in order to get to the back seats you have to open this up and you get in like this somewhat comfortable but it's uh, somewhat surprising too because as you can see here if I put if I, this back as it was I have plenty of room for the legs here and I have plenty of room here overall I'm six feet tall and I'm not really touching the ceiling overall I would say spacious back seats in this coupe you have a cup holders here as well better than I expected in terms of this infotainment system, you have different options here. As you can see,
Let's check out the trunk space on this coupe. As you can see here, pretty good trunk space in this coupe as well. You can also drop down these seats, back seats, and you have even more storage room here. You have a spare tire here with different tools, very convenient, beneath the floor of a trunk. Enjoy today's review of this beautiful 2018 Honda Civic EXT and I'll see you next time. Stay loving cars.